What's going on fam? Welcome to the FOMO channel. I'm Mr. FOMO himself. Today we're going to talk about Silesium and the launch, which kind of didn't go very well. <laughs> Is the best way I could put it. Um, before I jump into the video guys, just a quick one over here. If you're new to the channel, please take the time just to smash that sub button. Um, we are on a journey at the moment to uh, 1,500. Hopefully we can get there in a day or two. Um, I'm really hoping we can fly. Please hit the sub and don't forget the notification bell as well. Uh, all this definitely does help because it gives me some, some what, what, what I have to call brand equity so that when brands look at me, they can see value in what I am providing over here and I hope eventually I can leave my job and do this full time so one more thing I want to show you guys quickly at the moment is I'm still drawing from uh, AVEX savings as well this balance has gone down from 7,000 to 5,700 just keep an eye on that as well guys because you never know what's going to happen with that one you know so I've been drawing as uh, every on a daily basis I draw three so I mean hopefully it lasts the whole while but I, I don't think it will last 14 days that's for sure um, okay so jump into Silesium. So if you haven't seen what Silesium is about, I did a video like um, a couple of days ago, well, two days ago. Um, I did hit the number. I won't show you the group text, which is unfair for me to show you. I was talking to one of the guys who was quite close to devs, and they didn't want to give me a white lace. So that's fine. No issue there, I guess. And I can't have, have it all, can I? Um, so Silesium is a deflationary daily ROI platform built on the poly Polygon Net. Um, overall, guys, missing out on that was a blessing in disguise it's one of those where i lucked in yeah like i got a little bit lucky touch wood you know that um i didn't actually jump in so what happened let's go here um so i won't say the person's name who i talked to um but you know he seems to be posting a lot in this group for example um but we had a good chat and they didn't have any whitelist spots for me and not whitelist spots meant i dodged the bullet um so after the launch this is pretty much what happened is like you know um let's just go back to this one here so i'm just gonna keep going back because it was so much fun so here it is let's say so due to the modifications that we have made to our referral system everyone will need to use the vault address as the referral address at first deposit after you change the address to someone else's referral that is a measure this is a measure of bypassing the referral contract for those who have issues with the website it is hosted through if ipfs simply recenter the web web page and click enter don't refresh so th they had a ton of problems launching this year um, as it goes along you can see down here there's another big big like people were just you know like yeah so it's drama all the way forward yeah we're aware of the multiple errors we are the we the moderators have direct confirmation from the dev team that we are fixing the platform first and then handling all the errors for everyone else this will be done in a very fair where demand was triple what we expected. We did not understand the impact we had on the DeFi community. I could make a lot of comments to, about that, but I won't. Uh, I know how these things on the back end work, because I have a lot of experience in this area. But again, you know, let's let's just keep going and see what happens. Um, let's keep going down a bit further. I'm going to go right to the bottom, and I actually want to come back to here. Website is currently progressing to the new host. We are we speak, so the website will be down. We'll go down for a bit. After the other areas, we estimate that most of them will be resolved by tomorrow morning, and we will do our local test run to fix any errors that appear in the transaction process. We'll keep you up to date. I mean, people have already put money in, and now they bought into pre-sale and all that, and then it just went to shit. Um, let's go into. Uh, Website has been propagated to the new host successfully. Errors on the new week for fresh has been fixed. We next we will start incorporating the modifications to our guest estimation errors. I mean, the good thing about this is they have been pretty good at communicating what's been happening. But I, as the community itself, I think a lot of people pretty much there's a lot of fud, there's a lot of anger. Um, yeah, just I mean, I I got I just went out of the group. Yeah, um, so I just don't, don't just don't have time for this kind of kind of stuff. You know, site is under development. We're migrating to a new host. Do not compound claim or do any action as you will lose funds or staked earnings in the process after launch. Will yeah, so that's that's just where it's at, right? All save all funds are safe and all referral will work after pause. People who lost money were refunded. People, so that's the good thing, yeah. I mean, I'd love to hear from anyone who's been part of this whole process. Let me know what you guys think as well. If you 
if you guys did get your money back, I guess, you know, and um, if they are working to return your money, I'm pretty sure it all sounds legit and fair, and I'm sure they'll they'll be giving the money back. And you know, it'd be wrong not it'd be wrong if they kept the money. You know, this kind of process, it's not it's not a good thing for everyone. We understand it's flawed. We are we are under. We go and fix it. We'll unpause it two hours. Send the document to everyone. Our community is strong. It's not fair. Some people can sell, and some people can't. Prices up five x from launch. Are, we will learn from our mistakes. I mean, that's the good thing, right? They are, there's a positivity around it. They will learn from their mistakes. They'll try and fix this. But this is the first one on the Polygon uh, network is my understanding, I think. And it's been a disaster of a launch for them. I hope that everything goes well and they can bring it back to where it needs to be. Um, and I hope that they really, really, really fix whatever they need to fix. You know, um, because, yeah, I mean, I think it's not good for the community, right? Like, they should have probably... I mean, you, normally you test run all these things, you know. I, I don't know. I'm not them, so I cannot comment too much. But I can see that it was a real stressful period. It must have been a super stressful period for them. Um, must have been really hard for these guys here to put all of that together and then come back and try and figure this all out. Um, now it's... Yeah. What can I say that's going to make this better? Probably nothing, right? Um, so it's out. It's running. Um... I hope it works for them. I hope that no one lost money in this, and I hope that everyone's safe. Uh, I'm, I'm kind of glad I didn't get into it, and I'm just super happy that I'm not part of this process. Um, yeah, it's one, of the, one that I definitely dodged the bullet, so I want to thank the guy who said to me there was no whitelist available. You just saved me money. Yeah, thank you so much. And I definitely, myself, my end score is I will not be jumping into this. There's just too much going on. There's too much errors. You don't try, you know, like... There's already just way too much drama for this for me to jump into it, and I don't like jumping into projects that have this kind of drama. It's just not worth my time. And yeah, you guys should definitely do your own research if you want to jump into it. That's totally up to you. I'm not gonna. I'm not here to say you should or shouldn't. But I'm saying what I am doing because, again, I'm not a financial advisor. But legally, all I can say is that I'm not gonna jump into it. That's my decision. Yeah. Um, Dodge the bullet on this one here, guys. You know, um, I think there would have been a lot of fud going on, a lot of anger, you know, mismanagement. Every, there's all sorts of shit going on anyway, yeah. Anyway, that's all from me today, guys. Um, I hope these guys bounce back. I hope they set everything right, and I hope they have a good journey moving forward. I mean, we'd never want anything to be bad for anybody. We want the journey to always be good for everybody. Um, I hope everyone has a good day. Um, yeah. And uh, hopefully, hopefully we can all have a good week heading forth. Yeah, um, happy Wednesday to everyone. Thank you for taking the time to watch my videos as well. I really appreciate it. Let's hit that one thousand five hundred, guys. Uh, don't forget to smash that. And uh, if you smash the Twitter as well, hit me a follow as well. You guys are the best. Have a fantastic day ahead. Peace.